Hey everybody, I have great news. Uh, we're gonna announce the winner. So it's uh, been a fun challenge. I appreciate you guys participating. It's been really exciting and really fun and uh, I've learned a lot about um, the pitfalls and, and the um, concerns of people losing weight. I, uh, I'm always learning something new about that but I do really enjoy it so I appreciate uh, the opportunity to help you guys with your weight loss challenge. So let's get right into it. Uh, I have an announcement regarding the the top three and then another uh, less exciting announcement to make at the end, but let's just go straight to the winners. So in third place, we have Mary Polly Ziegler. So she went from 164 uh, point four pounds to 149.0 for a total weight loss of 15.4 pounds or 9.3%. Not bad. So um, really good job. So Mary Polly has been uh, really hardcore and worked really hard at this weight loss challenge. So congratulations to her in third place. So the second and first place, this is a rough one because the difference between them is so small it's almost painful to report. So just to let you guys know, it was extremely tight at the top, but here it goes. So second place, if I had a drum roll, I would definitely have it rolling right now. Second place, Christy Hooley. So she worked really hard. Uh, she had a lot of comments out there and stuff too, so she did a really good job. And, and congratulations, second place to Christy Hooley. Her numbers came in. Uh, start weight of 234.4, finished at 208.0, for a total loss of 26.4 pounds or 11.26%, which um, is really, really strong. Uh, excellent job. Now this is gonna break Kirsty's little heart because the winner came in at 11.91. So 11.91 versus 11.26%, such a small margin, but hey, that's the way uh, that's the way games are played. Like in football, they say it's a game of inches, and then I'm a Formula One fan, so it's a game of a thousandth of a second. So it's oftentimes like that at the top. But um, our winner is Brittany Seth. So she did a great job. Brittany had a zillion questions and stuff to ask me during the course of this challenge. We kind of became friends during this challenge because not only her, but several people communicated with me on a regular basis, but uh, she was pretty communicative and uh, she's a very deserving winner. So just by seven tenths, basically, she ended up taking the lead off of Kirsty Hooley. So tough break for Kirsty, but hey, uh, winning is really more about just getting your lifestyle in order so that you can stay in this weight loss for the rest of your life. So congratulations to them. The winners are gonna get a free month of Revital U. Uh, so you can have either coffee or cocoa or caps, but we'll work that out directly. And I think 13 something dollars from our GoFundMe uh, contributions that we had. It wasn't much, but hey, uh, it's something. So, uh, and, and on a, another note, I thought a lot about whether I should mention this or not, but I'm gonna just go ahead and put it out there just in case something comes of this uh, in a public sense. I did disqualify one competitor because that person uh, made a claim that I just felt like was uh, not possible, which was, basically a 3,500 calorie a day um, deficit resulting in nearly 40 pounds of weight loss, 39.6 I think it was. But um, I uh, do not believe that that is possible. If I am wrong, then I'm wrong, but uh, I don't believe that that's possible. I did have some dialogue with this competitor and some of the uh, conversation made it just seem a little uh, even more suspect. So. I only bring that up because I want everybody to know that I'm transparent about everything. So uh, anybody that wants to see the data or the conversation that I had with this person, you're welcome to ask me for it. Uh, I don't mean to put bad energy out into the world or anything like that. I just want to help people. So it gives me no joy to report this to you guys, but I just wanted you to know, you know what had happened. So if it ever comes up, uh, you heard it from me first. So. Uh, anyway, that's that's just the way things go sometimes, you know. Uh, it's just a little weight loss challenge for no money, and it's just for fun, really. And it's just for you guys to to learn to lose weight. So, anyway, uh, congratulations to Brittany Seth. She's a big winner. And just to let you know, I am in the process of making another weight loss challenge up 
hopefully in a couple of weeks. The new one is going to be a little bit different than this one. I've learned some lessons on this one that I'm not going to make the same kind of mistakes again, and I've done some other things that I think that will make it a better challenge in the future. Um, significantly, I am not going to do this one for free. Um, I am going to request that people buy some Revital U product from me, um, which, by the way, is completely refundable. If someone didn't like the product, they can uh, re return a completely empty a tub of their product and get their entire money back. Um, so it's either going to be that or a, a financial contribution of probably $49 to get involved. So if you have a friend that wants to uh, do this weight loss challenge, uh, maybe start setting that path in motion now if they can spare $49 for a product. Basically they get the product and the weight loss challenge is for free and if they don't like the product they can return it for a complete refund. So it's pretty hard to lose. You're just basically getting another free weight loss challenge, but uh, um, asking for follows on my social media didn't work out that well, which is really all I was asking for in the first one. I just didn't get very much from that, and I'd spent a lot of time on this, so I hope you guys can appreciate that. The, uh, the time investment and so on that it takes to run one of these is pretty significant. Doing the calculations for the winners and so on is also a time uh, commitment of significant proportion of, of time. So anyway, by the way, uh, tomorrow I will post the entire list of winners and where they came in and what their numbers were. So you'll get to see that posted on Facebook. Congrat but congratulations to Brittany uh, Seth and to our second place finisher, um, Kirsty Hooley and Mary Polly Ziegler, who also did extremely well. On average, the numbers uh, for weight loss came in around 4 or 5% on average. So just so you kind of know where that stands, but I'll put that again on our uh, Facebook page tomorrow. So congratulations to Brittany, Brittany Seth. We're gonna do another one of these probably in a couple weeks. I'll keep you guys posted with news on our page and we're gonna continue to work on weight loss even though the challenge is over for a couple of weeks. By the way, anybody that's in the challenge now, there's no fee for you guys. You're welcome to stay in and do a challenge again. So if you enjoyed it and you enjoyed learning uh, from me and like who I am, then I'll continue that basically on the next six week challenge. So. Congratulations again. Hope you guys had a great night. Um, sorry I'm getting this out kind of late, but I had to confirm a few things with some of the competitors before I was able to get confirmed numbers. So uh, I appreciate you guys being patient. So thanks again. I appreciate all the blessings you guys gave me. It's been a great experience for me personally, and I hope it has been for you as well. I'll be back with uh, more stuff between now and the start of the next one, so we'll all be in touch. Uh, good night, and congratulations again to the winners.